Alright guys, so I'm going to be a bit run. I'm Chevalier, glad you're happy with me. So, last episode we declared war on Scotland, and right now I'm actually in the process of, of uh, conquering them, as you can see. And also, I'm actually trying to find out if I can actually beat both England and Austria at the same time. Of course, I went to the bathroom and I started the episode without actually looking at it, because why not? And 25,000 with England having, uh, let's say, 11,000 if I squash them. Oh, they have no manpower, they are mercenaries. So yeah, I can most likely squash both Austria and England in the same war. But it's gonna be a long war, and my fleet... My fleet might get damaged. Let's actually look at the fleet as well. Because I might not be able to actually uh, go, when, go into the English mainland. Because I'll have to split my troops. It's not gonna be good for me. England. Yeah, they still have uh, 31 ships. Yes, so in order for me to beat England, I'll have to actually split my troops and have some of them on the English mainland and some of them have fighting Austria. And I simply do not have enough troops. I might actually have to, to pick between uh, squashing the squashing England or squashing Austria. And I might actually squash Austria. On the secondary front. Although this is gonna take too long, yes. Actually, I wonder. Now it now it's not gonna be possible. <clears throat> so my train of thought was to basically attack Savoy, while they're to both Aragon, Genoa, and Venice, and they're gonna call in Austria, and they're gonna call in Austria's gonna call in uh, England, Ferrara, and Genoa as well. So basically, and Hungary, which is gonna be too many guys for me to handle them. But yeah, we're just attacking England. Uh, they are gonna call in Desmond. Desmond is uh, is this? No. Wait, Desmond is. Oh, this one is this. So there's there no nobody. Gilray and Leash. They just stuck here, and Gilray. So yeah, it will be possible to basically. Try to squash the mainland and try to force my way into the Scotland, into the England, to force my way into England if I have the ships. But yeah, it remains to be seen if it's possible or not. And I need to increase my navy to deal with Denmark as well. So, plans, plans, and more plans. I have to deal with the Serbia as well. So, okay, Morocco, ready to my coast. I don't need claims on this guys. I don't need claims on province as well. I do need claims on nobody. Right. This is Corfu, this nine. I don't want to fight Ottomans to any degree. And Corfu is a vassal of Venice. Though I won't have the ships to fight Venice as well, so Again, let's actually fabricate on Kildare. And uh, economic build spy network. I'll get a claim on their on their capital and take the capital away from them. Okay, perfect. Let's save this guys again. Ox here and I'm gonna sweep them from that place to the other place and the Scottish, the Scottish Navy is nowhere to be seen. They're actually sieging me here. Guys, there. Let's go like this again. The second April. Most likely, once I take this fort, it's gonna be fine. Our ships are gonna be built, so that's gonna be good for me. Be enough to actually hold. I'm actually gonna send uh, two of my cabs to take this and this. Then I'm gonna start a fabrication, uh, clean fabrication on uh, on Norway. I'm just gonna keep the 
this here. Okay, they can move there. Why can you move there? Why can you move there? Like, I have ships here. I have ships here. I have fucking ships here. I have ships here. How can you actually move? How? How? How can you fucking move when your this is blockaded? Oh my fucking god, man. Paradox. Fix your fucking shit. Oh, I'm gonna lose those troops. So I need to send more. Save Paradox entrances. My attack is just brutal. Turn up June. You're like, you can't actually move in there. So option B, move here, I can move, move, move there, yeah, I can move there. Let's start to to our share. Like, there shouldn't be possible, you moving there shouldn't be possible when you're fully blockaded. And here should be able to... Oh, yeah, you, you, now you fucking attack me, you know? God fucking damn it. So fucking pissed. Uh, awesome. See, 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 God fucking damn it, paradox. Shoots are gonna be dead. 95, 93. God fucking damn it, paradox. I swear to God. Try to move here. Trade embargo, trade embargo, trade embargo, naval blockade. <coughs> this is where I'm moving to troops, okay. So, uh, so you are attacking Leash in a Burgundian conquest of Leash, and oh, this is this is genius. So basically, Burgundy at Orita, Austria, so I can actually deal with England and Austria. Yeah, this is perfect for me. Oh, the siege is not, the truce is not over. With me. No, oh, it's gonna be a while. Actually, they're gonna try to live in armor. And, uh, here's what I'm gonna, I'm gonna actually help, help these guys. Essentially, I get a claim, uh, fabricate claim on, uh, Combin. I call this. Go here. Or we get claim on Zeta. We call this guy as well. So basically, I want to kill the access that I had give to to these guys here, so that they won't be able to move their ships to the Burgundian lands. And I give access to Hungary, England, Brittany, Austria. Right, you are allied, right? Yeah. So, let's actually check really quick. So, that's not good for you. I really need to stop the English. If I can stop the Engli English army, you might be able to hold. You might be able to hold. If not, you might actually lose this war. I can actually join your war or some shit. No, uh, I can enforce peace, right? If I increase my relations with them to some degree. Okay, I cannot kill their access. 
That's not good for me. Okay, let's see. I'm definitely gonna lose the Hydra Emperor ship if this guy dies now. So, what did the next? This is a Ragnarok Council. For some unit Aragon, so. It might fire. But to be honest, the, the inheritance will fire. The. Not inheritance, the. Uh, Iber Wedding will fire right now. Because of the Ragnarok Council between these two nations. That's gonna make things a little bit trickier. Though that actually means that I can declare war on uh, Yeah, they're not that weak. They are dead here as well. They don't have that many ships that many troops there. We'll see how it goes, but my luck is not with me right now. And what is the issue? France is not clear on you. Yeah sure. Okay, so they are minus three, they lost. They lost the battle. Yeah, they're gonna lose the game of war. That's gonna be bad for me. Why would you actually declare war, man? They can't conquer Sargas Province. Like, I, I need to enforce peace. So, what to enforce peace? I need to be able to declare war on target. So who's the actual CP holder? C Leech, right? Why? Should I do the Fuck it. I'm really pissed. Let's see if I can actually move my ships here. To hopefully declare to blockade them. To win the siege faster. Kill on me. I'm <coughs> leaving my troops open here. Which might be a bad thing. Let's go in relation straight to Cologne. And with rear. Actually, mines. Yeah, with mines. Yeah, Burgundy might lose this. Yeah, broken the last. Stupidity itself. Not enough blockades. Okay, I need more. I don't care. Ah, shit. Ah, uh, yeah, I'll take this. Then I can actually drive ships. Need ports. Number of ports at this stand. I don't have 10 ports, really. Oh, this is not core, that's why. I have like 5 here and I have 5 here. I sh they should be core, monster core, I should be fine. But yeah, Burgundy losing this war is really bad <coughs> for me. For everybody. Actually, for me, not for everybody. Ah, come on! Don't die, don't die, don't die, don't die, don't die, don't die. Yeah, I'm not gonna lose my ships anymore from, from these places. They can rot for all I care. And you win fucking siege, man! For fuck's sakes, finally. I uh, retreat from, uh, from this guy. I have 91% for score game, it is this and this. That's the smallest, right? Yeah, this is, I don't care about the rest. And give me a war reps and other cash. I have to fight you for this. Wait, I need Sutland, I need the... Wait, I don't need inverse. I just need to make claims, so I don't need inverse. It's too expensive. 
any dark shard to move against England without uh, being afraid of their feet. Yeah, that should do it. Send the bands. Okay, what's in our troops? Here. Gonna kill our maintenance. Let me disaster. Why? Oh, clergy. That's why. Let's actually start. How is my... This, this is... I'll actually increase and wait a little bit. The six provinces, I should probably start from getting claims on Norway. <laughs> and support the independence of Sweden, perhaps? Ferdinand and Mecklenburg, so Denmark should die if I can get near Denmark. But that's gonna be tricky. So, who's next? Serbia should be next. Let's check the aggressive expansion map first. 52, 52, 41, England might join a coalition against me. Naples, Naples will not join. People State might join a coalition against me. Yeah, right now I'm really, really fucked. How much of this I'm gonna lose? I lose 2.4 per year. So I lose 2.4 per year, even with the... It's gonna be tricky. I still have to rely on the hatchery. And I cannot take any more lands. At least not right now. I'm gonna send my troops to the mainland. It's actually the kind of ships. Here. Okay, perfect, you're coming. Genius! Genius! Okay, so here's the deal. I will keep my troops on the English mainland. So I'm gonna increase the maintenance, wait a couple of months till I accept the call. Okay, that's good. This will mean that I'll actually squash England. And I'm actually gonna do this and uh, ask for Bale and Cumbria as well. They have been warned by England. They're allied with England. This one. Yes, yeah, so I can actually squash England on their mainland while I provide some support uh, against the. Uh, against the uh, this so I squashed the uh, English island while I prov provide support for the for Burgundy on the mainland. But first I need to send all of my ships here. Let's send this guys here. And also I'm gonna get my forts up and ready. I'm gonna accept next month. Actually, I think I'm gonna send a couple more troops. Uh, how many troops does England have? England, 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 England. Navy, that's Navy, sorry. Navy, 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 Navy. Uh, it's 18,000, and most of them should be around here, right? Yes, so I need to. I, I'll leave, leave 22,000 troops here. Now I'll actually take four with one. I'll take this or three thousand troops from here. Take this guy as well. Those are cogs in here. There's also cogs in here. There's also cog nine of this cog as well. I'm actually gonna leave you in Umbria 
so you won't take it for sure. Okay, I should have enough time, right? One month passed. I need three months. Recall, recall. I have one more guy ready. Let's see relations with the people state. Or no, 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 fabricate claims on Norway. I have to go to Denmark and uh, build spy network against Denmark. Where is the English feet? That's the main important part. Come on, hurry the fuck up. 36th, I'll accept. Perfect. Let's check the war status. Okay, now we're kind of even. If I squish England out of the war, should be even better. Conquer Maine. Eh, that's not gonna happen. That's not gonna happen as well. Conquer Maine. Maine is this, and nope. Now I have a, I'll have to improve relations with Catalonia as well. And yeah, I'm gonna move my troops to basically this guy's here. I need to have four and two here. With uh, four and two here. And this guy with this guy in charge is gonna go here. While uh, you have 12, I need you need uh, you need nine actually. So this will carpet search here. I'm convinced that you have all of your troops sent to the mainland, so you won't cause me any trouble. for the offensive morale. Okay, so England doesn't have that many troops left. Okay, so let's see. Okay, so I lose level to the clergy. So I have to choose prestige. If I get loyalty for the clergy, I cannot do anything with it. No. Either way, I'm gonna go to 40, which is good. I got this. Okay. Yeah, I'll take the prestige. Or their demands. Okay, let's look at the HR again. We're low. Okay, we won that battle, good. Okay, they want to move against me. Let's see this guy's here. This guy's here as well.
I do need an ability to have to raise additional levies from the nobility. Clergy is already killing me. I'll have to core this because I forgot. Because I stupid. No, or did I have to. Ah, that was bad for me. I guess I don't need this fort here. I don't need a 40 Normandy. No, the I might need a 40 Normandy. No, if England's trying to debark somewhere, I'm gonna be fucked. So. Okay, let's try to piss somebody out. I'll try to piss. Austria out. Let's actually do this. Because I forgot. Oh. Yeah, I'm gonna increase the favors. Let's actually see. Trust by 5. But yeah, for now I'm gonna increase. Uh, I'm gonna end this episode here. And uh, I'll see you next time. Again, if you like the content, consider subscribing or liking the video. With this, I bid you farewell. And I'll see you next time. Bye guys.